What is an OCO order and how do you use it on Binance? OCO stands for one cancels the other and is a unique type of order that allows a trader to place two separate orders at the same time. It combines limit orders and stop limit orders allowing only one to be executed while the other is simultaneously cancelled. Now before we show you guys how to use the OCO order, we would like to define or talk about what exactly limit orders are and what stop limit orders are as well. Limit orders are used to buy or sell a specific asset at a specified price or better. With buy limit orders, what happens is the order is executed at the limit price or below that, whereas with sell limit orders, the order is executed at the limit price or above that. The beauty of using limit orders is that you get the guaranteed price, you get the price that you're asking for, that specific price. But if the limit price is never met, then the order will never be executed. So that's something to keep in mind. With the stop limit order, a stop trigger is combined with a limit order, which allows the trader to set a minimum amount of profit they are ready to realize, while also setting the maximum they are willing to lose in case a trade doesn't go their way. Once set, a trader just has to wait for the stop price to be reached, so as for the limit order to be placed automatically. Now let's show you how to create an OCO order on Binance, which is the top crypto trading platform on the planet. The first thing you will need to do is obviously log into your account. If you don't have one, you can go ahead and use our link in the description. All you need to do is put in your email, uh, create a password, and then select create a personal account. You will need to verify your account to enjoy the full benefits of being a Binance platform user. The advantage of using our link in the description is that you get a 5% discount on all your trading fees for as long as you're a Binance user. Once you're logged in, go to the trade option on the menu bar and select spot. Select your preferred crypto trading pair at the top, ours is BTC BUSD, and then select the OCO order which will be located at the bottom of the page with other order types. Four entry slots will appear. These are price, stop, limit, and amount. Price refers to your limit order and will be first visible on your order book. Set this number wherever you would like to exit your position and take a profit if the trade goes your way. Stop refers to the stop limit trigger price which, once the price of the asset reaches, will replace the regular limit order with the stop limit order. Traders usually place a stop trigger slightly higher or lower than the stop limit price just so the order can have time to be filled at the correct price. Limit refers to the price of the stop limit order and will reflect on your order book after the stop price is triggered. Set this number to wherever you would like to exit your position and realize a loss if the trade doesn't go your way. Amount represents the value of your order. You'll be able to choose whether you want to make a sell order or a buy order. We'll be making a buy order, so we'll set the price we want to buy at 19,500 BUSD, the stop limit trigger price at 21,000, our stop limit order at 21,200, and our order will be all the available BUSD. After that, we'll click buy, and that's how easy it is to create an OCO order on Binance. Your order will reflect under open orders in two entries, limit maker and stop loss limit. The limit maker shows your preferred price at which your order will be executed, meaning Bitcoin will be bought. And the stop loss limit shows the maximum price at which you are willing to buy Bitcoin and take the loss. The OCO feature is great for people that don't like maybe to sit at a laptop while they are trading all the time. Maybe they want to set a trade and walk away and do other things while um, this automated feature allows them to take a profit when things are going their way and to exit when things are not going their way with a small loss. So that's something that you can take advantage of as someone that maybe is not an intense trader. But if you are an intense trader as well, maybe you want to take a break from your computer or your trading schedule and you just set an OCO order in order to allow you to benefit from the changes in the market. It's really great in a volatile market and that's why it's important because crypto is one of the most volatile markets, if not the most volatile markets in the present day. So if you're ready to use the OCO feature to make some money on Binance, then go ahead and use our link in the description to create your first OCO order. Until next time.